<laughs> you just say the Norwegian national word. What's the Norwegian national word? Yeah. Can you say it? Yeah. Yeah. Emmeline. Yeah, she's trying. She's trying. She did it perfectly though. So why is it the Norwegian national word? Because no other language in the world breathes in when they say yes. Yeah. Mm. Breathes in in general, I've never heard. Like it's probably some language weird far, far, far away, but yeah, maybe. It does that. But in no, in the modern, no, not in Norway's modern language, Norwegian. But oh my gosh, in Norway, it's like yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Has never been a problem. Like, <laughs> the hair is to actually like help with sweat. It's not to make you more sweaty. No, I know. But like, I'm never gonna be in the summer. I'm not never gonna be in May and be like, oh my god, my face is on fire. <laughs> I am I mean. so hot and sweaty on my face. <laughs> that's like, what I mean, it's not like, gonna happen. It's not well, gonna. When you look at someone with like a huge beard in the summer, I just think like, oh my god, that must be so hot. You know, that's why people cut their hair and stuff in the summer. You know, you always see like guys with beards that are working out or something and they're like really sweaty and it's, the sweat's just dripping into their beard. Like, that just means you don't trapped. feel it. That's, it means you don't feel the sweat. Like, yeah, but actually, you know, like, like, oh, I would be scrubbing my beard with like, like mm, to get like, really get the sweat out. But if you have a long beard, you shampoo it. Oh, do you? Yeah, you don't like collect food from last week. And... <laughs> but you really shampoo the long beard? Yeah. Really? It's hair, yeah. Okay. I've shampooed my chest hair. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's the norm, but <laughs> the mess that you left last night. Oh no, I found perfect. I hate when you can't find something because oh. the whole house looks like it's trash. <laughs> when I look for something, I just tear through the house and I like dump everything out until I can find what I need. Not just that, you never put it back. No, I left it out by act. No, I left it out because Henry was in there and I felt bad. I didn't want him to. He was sleeping in the toy thing, toy bag, and I felt really bad, so I didn't want to take him out. So I just I left it. Well, I'm not a fan of this deconstructed toy box. Well, Emily That's likes it, so here. she loves it. Of course, she loves it. It's toys. Yeah, their cars, listen, she's making them really cute. Ferrari. She's got a Ferrari, a, was it a Chrysler? And an old Rolls Royce, is it? So today is the day I'm going to get my hair done. I'm definitely going to take a before and after picture because sometimes it's really difficult to see like the changes in it if you have before and after. I mean, like for me, it's probably going to look a lot more different than it is to you, but I'm really excited anyway. I have cleaned the kitchen, I've been really efficient, Emily's with Nanny, and I'm just trying to gather stuff. I'm at this point right now where I kind of, I'm like, oh, I don't really know what to do with like a lull in time before my appointment. Excuse me. <laughs> I've got to find pants though, I know that, and it's super hot in the salon, so I'm wearing a tank top today. My summer tank top, as you can see. <laughs> um, yeah, it's weird for me to be gone for this long from Emily and I think the longest I've ever been gone from her was like three hours and that was when I was getting my hair done and she was at home. This time Alvin has to drive me to the place and then he has to drive back with Emily and alone. So we're a bit nervous about how that's going to be because you know she hates to be in her car seat. So hopefully that's going to go well. <laughs> This is a great workout, honey. Yeah, I bet. There's <laughs> like weighted, weighted jumps. <laughs> weighted jump squats. Okay, I just, I'm getting ready to go. And, <laughs> look at them. <laughs> I just, we're getting ready to go and I put on a pair of jeans that were just washed and they're so tight. It's like, ugh. you know when you just wash your jeans and you put them on, you're like, mistake. They'll, they'll, they'll even out once I sit, but still, it's, oh. Look, they're like super tight right now. Super tight. 
don't like it. All right, I gotta get ready to go because I have not been efficient at getting ready to go and we need to leave. So I'm gonna quickly throw some food together because I'm gonna be there for so long. So we're on our way and then I'm gonna be at the hair place for quite a long time. I'm gonna take a before and after picture. I'll have the people at the salon do it and we'll see. This is my office today. Just sitting here, chilling, my office. Rymeline? Mommy's doing her hair in Darby. Far away, isn't it, Meline? For hours and hours. No, it's just four hours. Plus travel there and back. We got back about two hours ago, and she screamed like crazy in the car, and uh, she was so tired, I didn't see the point in stopping. So I just went back, back home all the way. Um, she only screamed for like 10 minutes and then I tap, tapped her chest a little bit and she finally fell asleep, which is a big deal for Emmeline. She doesn't fall asleep in the car, usually. It's happened like twice before. Um, right, Emmeline? Are you gonna go, go on the slide? Ski? So I'm just trying to get some work done. Hi, can you say hi? Can you say hi? Yeah. Or is that right? I completely agree. Does that mean you you well, you telling me your your vote leave or vote stay opinion for the for the referendum, Emily and Bean. <laughs> Here comes Chelsea too. It's a really nice day out though, so it's it's not a bad office. Can't complain. I'm videoing my hair. Look at that. <laughs> Alright, let's talk about this for a minute. I thought I could make my train. So I basically ran. The walk is supposed to be like 30 minutes. So I like ran all the way here. Hopefully you can hear me over the train. I ran in and I didn't think I was gonna make it. I got so frustrated because I was like, I'm sweaty, I'm gross. I haven't been with Emily in for like five hours, so there are other parts of me that are having issues, and I'm just like, oh my god, it was so frustrating. So I missed it and then I had to buy another ticket and now then I have to go somewhere else. I have to go to a different train station now and then Alvin's gonna drive farther to pick me up so it kind of defeats the purpose of me taking the train and oh, I don't know and I, I haven't really vlogged at all today because I've been getting my hair done and oh, it took my five hours look oh, I love it it's so much better it literally took five hours first she had to pull my roots out and then she put one color and another color so it took forever but it looks amazing I'll put like a before and after picture so you can see at the end To go park somewhere and walk to the train station. Hi, were you with Super Daddy today? What's that face for? What's that face for? Can you wave? Hi. Oh, you're sweet. Hello, hello, two of the best people ever. Hi. What are you doing? They had. A day without me and they survived and they had a great day because and I know that I know they had a great day because they're both in really good moods yeah Emily's higher but nose nose no. where's Emily's nose nowhere it's eye eyes <laughs> where's a uh, beard shag where's shag did your papa shag she does that now yeah <laughs>
I don't have a shag, no. No shag. What does shag give mama? No. Yeah, no shag. Oh, sorry. <laughs> he hit me. Ata? Say good night. Can you wave? Can you wave? He said good night. I'm going to bed. Little kiss. Yeah. Very good. What do you think? Really nice. Yeah? Yeah. I love it. I love it. No more coppery blondes. No more roots to here. No more line. Just nice color. I love it. Very happy. It was worth the forever many hours, four and a half hours that it took. Did you get to read your book? <laughs> I did actually, but not very much because I talked really? to the hairdresser. <laughs> you would. And then I looked at a magazine because I was looking at movie reviews. It was like on the movies that have come out from all around the world, actually, a magazine. Yeah. And so I was able to look at that and see what's good. <laughs> So we're going, bye! This hair, it's balayage. It's a French technique where they basically paint the highlights in your hair. They don't, it's not the same, not with the foil. So what will happen is when this starts to grow out, I won't get the line. You know the line that you get? You've been seeing it in my videos, come on. It's like a line, <laughs> you won't get that. Here you go, you can see. It's dark on the top here. Like my, that's my real hair color there actually. And it's just got, Blend, I've blended some light into it. I've left the bottom dark here. That's my real hair color. Right there. That's my real hair. It looks darker on the camera. It's lighter than that. It is blonde, but it's just a dark blonde. Um, and then I've put some light on the top. So let me see if Alan can help me and I can show you from the back. See what it looks like. Okay. Can you see it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There. Yay. I am so sore. The front side of my legs, it, the whole front from the thigh all the way down to the ankle, it's just sore. It's like I, I did sprints, a million sprints. It's hilarious. But I pretty much ran. Like I sped walked. Don't ever knock the race walk, I tell you. Pretty much sped walked from the hair salon to the train station. And I'm gonna tell you, it's like a 35 minute walk. I walked that in 15 minutes, so I was really going. And no, it's more than like 20 minutes, but still, I'm ex I was exhausted. My legs killed, and then I missed the train, and blah. I mean, it's been a good day. It's been a, it's been a good day. <laughs>